Hey, how's it going? Alex here from Ideaspot, and I'm back with another WordPress tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to be setting up the Akismet plugin. Akismet is a plugin that's used to stop email spam on your WordPress website. So if you've been using a WordPress website and you've noticed that you've been receiving some spam, you'll definitely want to set this up. So if that sounds good, keep watching. Okay, so firstly, the most common source of spam are the contact page and the comments section on your WordPress site. So um, you may have noticed that spammers have been coming over to your contact page, automatically filling this out, and then your email inbox is filling up with um, random annoying spam messages. So that could come from your contact page or it could come from your blog page if your blog page has the um, comments turned on in the bottom there, which can be good. Um, but if you've been receiving those kind of spam emails, then head over to your plugins and we're going to want to set up this one called Akismet. So a lot of times Akismet is already included and installed in your version of WordPress. Um, if not, just go to um, add new plugins and then just search for Akismet and install it. But um, very, very often it's already automatically installed, but I'll just do that for this tutorial at Kismet. And then you'll see it'll pop up. It'll be the first one. So here we go. We just click install now. We can see it has 5 million active installations. So it's it's by far the most popular anti-spam plugin. And that, that's just because it's, um, it's bundled with so many um, WordPress installations. Okay, now that that is installed, we click activate and wait for that to activate. Okay, and straight after you've hit activate, Akismet will give you this um, screen and you'll be asked to set up your Akismet account. So just go ahead and click that. So you'll be taken to the akismet.com website and click set up your Akismet account. So now we just need to fill out this form with our email address and a username and pick a nice password as well. There we go and create the account. So here, Akismet will ask you to choose your plan. So if you're just using this for a um, personal website or a personal blog, uh, you can use it for free. Just name zero as your price. Um, if you're using it as a professional uh, business website or a commercial website, um, seven Australian dollars, I think that's five US dollars, and um, unlimited websites for, um, I think that's $50. So um I'm just going to use this as a, um, a personal one and set up a free account. So it's fairly easy to do. Just drag that down to zero. Um, then we just need to fill in this form. So let's just go ahead and fill that out. I'm going to use it style soul. I'll just put idea spot as my name. And you have to verify that because this is the personal plan that you don't run ads, you don't sell products and you don't promote businesses. And then you can use the free personal subscription. So that will generate your new API key and you'll just click there. It'll automatically save it for you in your dashboard. So that will take you back to your WordPress dashboard. Akismet will be pretty much set up and there's not much else to do here. Now you can leave all of this on default and it will work just fine. Uh, if you'd like, you could use the second lower strictness level. If you'd actually like to read the spam and make sure it definitely is spam, but most of the time it's easier just to use the first option. And in terms of privacy, depending on which country you're in, you may or may not need to display uh, the privacy notice. Generally just leave it turned off. That's fine. Now, the only disadvantage with Akismet is that it's not free for businesses. It's not free for commercial websites. So if you'd like me to recommend a plugin that will work on your commercial site for free, um, Take a moment, hit the subscribe button because I'm going to cover that in a future video. But anyway, if this has been helpful, click the like button, click the subscribe button anyway, because I'm going to be back every week with more helpful WordPress tutorials that can help you with your WordPress website. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on the Akismet anti-spam plugin. Um, thanks, and I'll see you next time.